Lavino versus Sevu. Who's actually better? PUBG Mobile has transferred its growth to other aspects of the gaming community. Apart from the game's meteoric development in mobile esports, streaming culture has also benefited significantly. PUBG Mobile has influenced streamers around the globe and has motivated them to play the game while also entertaining their fan base. In this video, we will compare two popular streamers who have made a name for themselves by broadcasting this popular game. Levinho. The ID of Levinho is 54659056151. In-game name: Lovo. YouTube channel: Levinho. All detail is also available in the description box. Levinho is a very popular PUBG Mobile streamer from Sweden. He has 8 million subscribers on YouTube and over a billion total views on his videos. He uses the four-finger control and a gyroscope to play PUBG Mobile. Levinho has played 1,039 squad games in the European server and won 83 out of them. He has a humble win percentage of 8 and K-slash-D ratio of 4.69%. He has an amazing 4,872 kills to his name, out of which 1,212 are headshots, for a headshot percentage of Sevu, PUBG Mobile ID 5181866304. In game name Mahmood, YouTube channel Sevu. All detail is also available in the description box. Sevu, also known as Spoidermon, is a famous PUBG Mobile streamer from Sweden. He has above 4 million subscribers on YouTube and over 541 million total views on his videos. He uses the four-finger control and a gyroscope on his iPad to play the game. Sevu has played 901 squad games in the European server and won 70 of them. He has a win rate of 7.8% and a K-slash-D rate of 4.58%. The content creator has also registered 4,126 kills in total, out of which 860 are headshots. He has a headshot percentage of 20.8. He has played a mere four games in the duo mode, which are too little to analyze. Who is better? Levinho and Sevu are both amazing players and entertaining streamers in PUBG Mobile. In terms of statistics, they are very close to one another and there is little to no difference in their overall performance when we look at the numbers alone. The former has a slight edge over his compatriot with a higher K-slash-D ratio, but we will consider this comparison a deserving tie for both parties. 
However, it will be interesting to see how they stack up against each other further down the road in Season 18 and how they compete in the next one as well. Let's look at their fights. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon for more updates and notifications. Stay safe and we will be back soon with another video.